Firstly, all the candidates uh, are given one minute to read the stimulus. Okay, now uh, all the candidates are given two minutes to prepare uh, all response. Okay, firstly, uh, as we all know, uh, the use of technology is becoming more sophisticated uh, day by day. Various facilities have been made by the scholar to facilitate the daily life of human beings. One example is uh, social media. Social media has many advantages, but they are also disadvantage and danger is if we do not use it properly. It can be dangerous and risky if user uh, constantly share important personal information. In my opinion, approving a uh, friend request from a uh, familiar contact is the best way of action to do reduce the risk and danger of using social media. If we are hit by a disaster like our bank account being hacked by a foreigner, we as consumer uh, can ask for help from friends on social media. Uh, we can also ask for help from friends we know on social media and those friends will do their best to help us. So uh, with a lot of friends, we can make them a, a bulwark when using social media. That's my point. Right, that's a good point, Naim. But for me, I think that the most effective way to uh, uh, take in when using social media is to avoid sharing live location. Uh, as we know, it is easy to share information with your online friends nowadays. Platforms like social media make it simple for us to broadcast to our family and friends, and even to strangers. Apps like Facebook and Instagram allow you to tag your photos with the place they will take it in meanwhile snapchat allows you to share your live location uh, when it is stream live if you share your location to anyone who can view your social media they may be able to find you in person which could be very dangerous if you have children they may be sharing their location on social media which could put them at a high risk of unwanted contact from strangers this could be prevented by making sure that you turn off your live location on your phone. Besides that, always check your privacy settings on your social media so that you're only sharing your posts with people who you trust. You can still connect with your friends and family without sharing too much information. So that's my point of view. Okay, thank you Aisha. As we know, modern day acquisition have transformed technology into more sophisticated and easily accessible so that people can easily search for or access other people's information using sophisticated applications. With these available facilities, many people take advantage by seeking other people's information for self-interest, such as bank info information. In this case, people need to take actions from being the one of their victim so that people need to set all their accounts to private. With better technology and increase in online activity, it's become difficult to control who sees your content. Being private helps with that. Having a private account gives you more control than being public does and it limits who has access to your content. This is the biggest plus and you can decide who is watching you. This is the best way to do to prevent your account from being stolen. Thank you. <coughs> okay, uh, thank you, Adila, uh, for the point. 
Okay, for me, the most effective step that can be taken when using social media uh, is refrain sharing photos of family members. Okay, why should we avoid posting family photo, uh, from family pictures? It is because even though we made a private account, most likely, uh, most likely there are some of our family members who are uh, unprivate their account on social media. And next, uh, people who want to do bad things on our social media account may know our family members and with refrain our sharing, uh, sharing photos of our family members can avoid uh, other people to easily get to know our family members. Okay, other than that, if we are sharing photos of family members, it will be a security threat to our family. So, other people can easily do a bad thing to our social media uh, and we cannot go, I uh, cannot, I uh, what uh, just like we cannot know how to prevent. So just with reference sharing photo of family member can avoid us from betrayed like that. And uh, and if we are we are still sharing our uh, photos of family members, it can be dangerous and risky for us. That is all for my point. Uh, okay, uh, for me, uh, I agree uh, with the first point, uh, which is uh, share, sharing uh, live location. In my opinion, uh, if we regularly share about our direct location, it can be as uh, dangerous as someone who has long want to revenge us on something. Of course, he will be able uh, to easily identify our current location. Instead, uh, we should avoid sharing current location to curb unwanted things. That's the point. Thank you, Naim. I couldn't agree more with what Lerna said, uh, which is refrain, we should refrain sharing photos of family members on social media. But I personally think, because it is about privacy, but I personally think that we should always avoid sharing live location because for some safety reason, avoid sharing uh, location publicly. Uh, it is to avoid from us to expose to creepers, such uh, to sending to internet recipients, uh, and we should avoid posting in our publics, such as Twitter and Facebook. So that's my point. Okay, thank you, Aisha. For me, I'm totally agree with Naim's point. Uh, for me, if you accept a friend Prayer request from a fake profile set up by a hacker. They cannot only see everything you upload to your account. They can download your photos and information and set up a fake account using your name and sending requests out to all your friends. Once that happens, their method of operation can get the dozens or hundreds of accounts, which uh, allows them to send those new friends spam and links to malware. When you get a friend request from someone whose account was hacked, this is likely how it happened. That's all for me. Uh, okay, um, for me, um, I'm, a, I'm agree with Aisha's point, which is uh, avoid sharing live location. Um, for us, don't bother sharing your location on a nature hike. Most national parks, for example, uh, in remote areas with no cell connection. So turning on location in this situation will, will waste um, battery life. So just like Naim said, um, other people can easily trace and identify our location and it may be risky and dangerous for us. That's all for me. Uh. Do you mind if I add something? Uh, I little bit uh, disagree with uh, with the point number two, which is uh, set account to private. Uh, in my opinion, uh, setting an account to privacy is not the best part for us as social media user. Uh, 
Uh, this is because uh, if we set our account to privacy, it will be a problem to others when we are in trouble. Uh, and uh, the others uh, who want to help us uh, is a little bit difficult to help us because uh, our accounts was privacy. That's my point. Okay. Uh, to include to include all opinion that have been given, uh, we all agree uh, with the first point, uh, which is uh, avoid sharing live location. Okay. Uh, that's all from us. Thank you.